Welcome to the demonstration of Transmission Tower application. This application helps to locate transmission towers and view its details. It also provides a facility to view the details of the neighboring properties such as cadastre lots, land use, population centers, and incidents for the selected vicinity. Launch the application by typing the appropriate URL. Once the application is loaded, the transmission tower screen appears, displaying the base map and the interface options in the top right corner of the screen. Following interface options are available. Search by tower ID, switch base map, show high details panel, on off full screen and help. Let's have a look at the interface panel at the top right corner of the screen. Search by tower ID. Helps locate the transmission tower by specifying the desired tower ID. Switch base map. Provides the option to switch the base map from street view to imagery view. Show hide details panel. Provides the option to show or hide the details panel at the bottom of the screen. On off full screen. Provides the option to on or off the full screen view. Help provides online help. Now let's see how to locate transmission towers. Click the desired transmission tower icon on the map. And the details of the selected transmission tower are displayed in the bottom panel. You can also locate transmission towers based on their ID. Click search by tower ID icon, specify the desired tower ID and click find tower ID button. The selected transmission tower is identified by the transmitting signals on the map and the details of the tower are displayed in the bottom panel. Now let's have a look at the details panel. The details panel provides information of the selected transmission tower and its neighboring properties such as the cadastre lots, land use, population centers and incidents for the selected vicinity within the transmission tower. The vicinity area can be configured while deploying the application. You can move the slider to view the details panel. Cadastre lots for the selected vicinity area are listed. You can move the slider to view the list. Click the desired cadastre lot and it is highlighted on the map providing the detailed information of the selected lot. Various land use such as transport, parks and open spaces, low, medium and various other details are available. Just click on the arrow and the list moves on. By default, the details for the transport are available. Click the desired land use in the slider to view the further details. Select the desired land use to view the detailed information. The selected land use is highlighted on the map displaying the detailed information. Similarly, we can view the details of the populated centers. Now let's see how to view the details of the available incidents. The incident panel provides the status of the open and closed incidents. Open incidents are highlighted in red and closed incidents are highlighted in green. Click close to close the panel. You can also access the details panel by selecting the appropriate tab available at the bottom panel. Thank you for viewing this demonstration.